Hey guys, I'm back again with another video. Um, this one was requested by Two Subbies and it was also the next video on my list. So, uh, went ahead and made it and it's about lock problems. Specifically, lock thinning, lint, and um, like, um, I guess the tips and ways to prevent all of that from happening um also we're going to get a little bit into combining but let's get into a lot of things now i've had my locks for five years and we're going on six this coming in february or march i never ever 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 had any problems with lock thinning anywhere except for in the top of my head in the last four months and when I realized that my hair was thinning, I flipped. I mean, I freaked out. I really did. And I'm usually so like, oh, it's just hair. It'll grow back. But it's like, no. Because when I saw my hair thinning and I felt it, I just lost it for a minute. You know? <laughs> so I don't know. Um, my, my thinning, I'm 100% sure, was due to stress. Stress related. I say this because I've never had a problem with lock thinning anywhere in my hair in five years. Um, it's, I haven't done anything different or drastic uh, with my hair or my diet or anything. But I have been under a tremendous amount of stress um, and anxiety in the last like six months to a year. And I've noticed the thinning in the last three to four months. And I think that's what it is. Like, I don't have any proof, but I think that's what it is. I don't think it's, like, genetics. I don't think it's alopecia or it's not that bad. Like, I'll show you. This one here. Now, some of you will say that's not that thin or some of you guys will n notice that it is a little thin. But my hair and the top of my head has always been the thickest part of my head. So, my locks untwisted would be about this thick before I twisted them up. So, for me to go from this much hair to like this much hair and I can feel it and I can feel like the, the breaking, the breakage and everything around it. So, what I did was I got some castor oil, only a little bit because it was all that my friend had. She let me have it and... um I read that it was good for thickening, thickening your hair up, and I used it. I stopped twisting my hair completely. Like, I just didn't twist it anywhere. I, like, maybe twisted the edges or sometimes when I was getting ready to go out. Uh, but other than that, I stopped twisting. I did not condition it because I didn't want anything. I wanted to see how well, like, the little casserole I used would work. And I know conditioning your hair sometimes um, can break it off if you do it too much. So I um I didn't condition. I used the castor oil. I used a little olive oil, and I kept it moisturized, like with my. Oh. Talia Waji, remember I was talking about her. I love these products. Um, kept it moisturized with that and water spray, and I tied my hair up. This I can't stress enough. Have to tie your hair up because if not a lot of friction it's not gonna stop the it's gonna encourage breaking really if you do it on a regular basis if you sleep with your hair not tied up on a regular basis your hair will break off and thin start to look raggedy and uneven it's just it's gonna happen okay so tie your hair up if at all possible it's in it's important to do that and that's what i did i've noticed that it's grown it's growing back it's not where it used to be at all not even by a long shot but it's growing back and I can deal with that and I'm looking for uh, better days because I don't need I cannot have y'all I cannot have locks coming at the top of my head I can't have that it's just I don't know so I'm not even gonna think about it um so that's that use some castor oil tie that hair up um yeah moisturize don't over twist the next problem that we all are going to have to inevitably deal with um lock length 
like a build up. Um, this is almost, you can't prevent it from happening. You can lessen the amount of lint that gets into um, your hair, definitely, but you cannot prevent it. So don't even try. <laughs> You'll end up probably taking, breaking your hair out, trying to keep lint from getting your hair. What I would suggest, what I do, I do not dry my hair with white towels. Like, I would use a black t-shirt before I use a white fluffy towel. Because lint is going to get in there and it's going to get lodged in. And once that happens, it's like, I mean, I have lint in my hair now. Sometimes I don't even, I don't know, I can't, I'm here somewhere. I don't feel like looking for any, but they, it's in there. I don't even try to pick it out now. I'm just like, whatever. Um, the lint itself is not going to cause your locks to break. Uh, if anything, it would probably keep them babies tight, held together. But if you try to pick the lint out, it's, it's unsightly. It's not aesthetically pleasing to the eyes. It looks like your hair is dirty, even when it may not be. So, um, what I would suggest is sleeping on a dark colored pillow, tying your hair up at night, drying with a darker towel, and if you can't get the lock, lint out if you can't get the lint out of your hair this is what I would suggest dye your hair the same natural color as your lock your locks already are professionally if you can get them done or if you got to do them at home okay but I mean go professionally get your hair dyed it's natural color and from that point on start taking better care of your locks as far as tying them up and um, stay away from greasy products like beeswax no like no okay no beeswax and um using darker towels and things like that um sorry guys so that's about it um try those suggestions out let me know if they work for you if you have any more suggestions or if you have any more uh comments questions any requests for videos you know what to do leave them down below like this video for me please and um I think that's how y'all like my earrings. Mm -hmm. They match with my nails. I did these nails myself. These acrylic nails myself. Last night was my first time too. So I'm kind of proud of myself. And um, thanks guys for watching. Have some more videos.